repaint something. And it is... Oh, it's a seven-year-old Alexander's artwork. I was seven that time. <laughs> it's, it's embarrassing. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's like a four, a five or six-year-old who paints this. <laughs> Wait, when when my mom was um cleaning up and then she just like looked at some drawer to keep some things, and then she saw this bag and she said. Biff, this is my painting, you know? If <laughs> I will paint like this, you know? And I just like I I just laugh. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna repaint this. I it's very, very good. What a beautiful leaves it has. I call this painting ugly flower. An ugly flower in in, in the worst my... painting ever. <laughs> if I compare my five-year-old drawings and my seven-year-old painting i would say that my seven-year-old painting is the worst painting i have in the history this is the worst painting of the year this awards worst painting of the year the awards goes the award goes to this one worst painting of the year <laughs> so let's repaint it because I don't, I, I don't know what is up with these. So let's get started. So I'm just going to use acrylic into the fabric. I know, I know we need to use fabric paint since it is fabric. But um, I just like um, paint it just to cover it. I'm not actually going to use it. I'm just going to keep it to make it memorable. Not like actually use it. Um, I know you. I know that I need to use fabric paint, but since my fabric paint dried a long time ago, I need to use acrylic. I mean, acrylic is alright, right? I mean, it says that can use any surface, right? Um, I remember I get fabric paint on my clothes and it wouldn't wash off. I mean, fabric paint is like, uh, acrylic paint is like acrylic, right? I, I don't know. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. Ouch. Okay, so first I'm going to cover the flower, the, um, the well-made painted flower. When I was seven, I thought that this painting uh, was the best painting. I, I don't know what is up with my seven-year-old brain, but I thought it is the best painting. <laughs> and I'm just gonna do the second coat. I'm already done with the first coat. Now it's the second coat. And still not just finish with the second coat. Um, my mom who was taking a video, she was like, oh, the flower is gone. <laughs> um, when I was seven, I was really proud of the f that flower. But now I feel like that flower is like, it needs help. While I was painting the second coat, I am planning what to paint on my bag. And... I decided that I'm going to paint an anime girl. Um, me and my mom just like um find some ideas in Google, just like just some inspiration, and she just told me you can draw an anime girl or something, and I'm like, okay, sure. But um, since I am very scared of drawing an anime girl in a bag. Um, I just, I just, um, find some other ideas, but after how many minutes, I decided that I am going to paint an anime girl, because I need to face my fears in drawing an anime girl. Now I'm sketching it, almost done sketching, I know you cannot see the sketch so well, but I'm sure I was sketching. Alright, so it is just me um, trying to draw the hand, uh, which, spoiler alert, I get rid of the hands. <laughs> now I am going to mix the colors. I'm going to make a skin color. Since 
my orange paint died. I need to use yellow and uh, and red to mix together to make it orange, and then put a lot of white. And it was just me trying to get the perfect skin color. One eternity later. Finally done with mixing the perfect skin color, and I'm very proud. <laughs> I'm very proud. I, it's the skin color I want. It's the skin color that I expected. I'm proud. <laughs> Alright. So, I'm gonna paint the face. Alright. So, the reason why I am scared in painting an anime character in an object is because... Uh, I have a very horrible flashback. And I cannot stop thinking about it. Alright, so I'm gonna paint the shadows. And I don't really know where the shadow should go. I you know every time when I draw a picture or do digital art, I would just like put the shadows almost everywhere. Like I I don't know. <laughs> I'm not an expert artist anime drawer <laughs> that's a weird sentence um, I just try my best to make this bag as um, satisfying to me as possible oh that is a very weird sentence too now I'm gonna paint the hair I'm gonna let you guys watch the process for a while and I will be back. Alright, so I am back and I am so not yet finished painting um, the hair. And now I am ready to put the shadows and the highlights. Alright, I am gonna put the shadows. Um very very um confident I'm very confident in putting the shadows. Now the highlights. Okay, we skip the highlight. Um we just skip the highlight because since I'm scared that the video might be too long. Alright. Now I am going to paint the flowers in her head. My mom told me to make it every kind of flowers but I don't think that's really possible so I just paint a white flower a pink flower a red flower and yes I made what I do what my mom said <laughs> uh, at first I'm like mom the do orange flowers exist and she's like of course it exists and I'm like I never saw an orange flower before and I'm like oh I, I saw an orange flower before um yeah I would call myself a forgetful person. That's all you have to know. Now, I am painting a blue rose flower. Um, I mean, blue rose flowers exist, right? You just dip it in the paint. I don't, I don't know if it actually exists. Okay. So, now I am mixing the colors and then painting the background. I'm gonna paint the background um blue. At first, my plan was I'm going to paint the her background turquoise, but I didn't put enough green, so it it became blue instead. I understand color theory, but I I I didn't put enough to uh, to. Uh, what is wrong with my um speaking? Okay. <laughs> um, it just turned into blue instead. I didn't have enough green. Green almost died. That's that's all. 
I'm going. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Right now, I am very excited and I'm very happy that I have accomplished something because this is coming together. I am proud. I finally faced my fear in drawing an anime. After that, um, really bad flashback I have of drawing an anime character on my shorts in all seven. Beautiful. <laughs> my plan was I am going to paint some flowers in the um, vines over here. Um, I know it doesn't look like a, it doesn't look like vines to you, but for me, it is vines. <laughs> right now, I'm gonna draw the pupil of the eyes because I am very. <laughs> At first, I am going to use my outliner and, and then draw the eyes first so I can paint the pupils in the um, place that I actually want it to be. But I decided to paint the pupils first because I just remember that the paint is going to cover the, the um, marker that I just out, that I just the eye that I just draw and it's gonna cover the marker. Wait, um, you know what I mean, right? Um, you know, my marker and then you just know. <laughs> Alright. So, like I said before, I get rid of the hands. <laughs> I was trying so hard to like draw the hands perfectly. But my mom was like, uh, just, just cover the hands. Just, just, just um, delete the hands. <laughs> so I'm like, okay. Now I'm gonna outline the flowers, which I am very proud of. While I was outlining the flower, I'm just keep on looking at um the painting of the face of the anime face, <laughs> and it looks like a beginner drawing it. But I'm going to write my name. No, the anime girl is not named Alexa. guys. Thank you so much for watching. And that's all for today. Bye, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.